All right, hello everybody. My name is Cats Games. Welcome back to episode six of Resident Evil Village. We just entered the dollhouse, wherever the fuck that is. We're getting this game, you know, finished, and I think San Andreas is gonna come uh, come after I finish Resident Evil uh, because I don't want to get spoiled. So I need to finish this game as soon as possible. It's fairly short, anyways. We're only three hours into it, though, out of the eight or nine that there is. So yeah, we're making some progress compared to GTA, which is like. I think I'm doing that for five months. This is a picture of me yeah, from Resident Evil 7. Or... Is it from 7? Is this... a doll of... Mia? M Mia? Uh, can I touch the pussy? Uh, remove... I can look. Is that her ring? Surely you can remove it. There you go. That's Mia's ring. Can I clean it? What if I inspect it? Um, remember that one silver ring we had? I think that went with that emerald thing. Remove leg. What's in here? Ooh, a key thing. Winded key. So I guess we have to look at this thing and just find the area. Find some stuff, pretty much, in here. Um... What is that? How long are you gonna stare at it? What is that? Okay, maybe there's nothing there. As to remove the right shoulder. Alright, that's a part of the key. Oh! Okay. Um, do I combine this with the other thing? Can I? I guess not. Inside the dolls, it looks familiar. It kind of does, to be honest. Oh, I can use this. I want to kind of go inspect the body more because there was another part we could examine. Because I was like... I was examining this yesterday, or the last day I recorded, but... What do you want me to do here? There's something in his mouth. You need some kind of tool to get it. You could you could use your fingers. I was playing around with this, but I, I didn't want to get too far into it. And I need another thing. These bandages are tough. Okay, I need to cut them. So I need a knife. And I need, like, something else to get the, the thing out. What can I do with the arm? Can I do anything with this arm? He just puts it down. I can't do anything with the arm, so uh, we move. <clears throat> um, yeah, this this area is sketchy. It's weird. I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's go in here. It's a pretty nice house, but just. It's- the doll stuff is weird. <clears throat> That's locked from the other side. Nice. As every fucking door in this game. Apparently this game is like a lot- like it's pretty much Resident Evil 7 and Resident Evil 4 combined. Uh, I haven't played Resident Evil 4, but I'm hoping to play that in the future on my channel. Only real way I get games done is if <laughs> I, I do a let's play on them. Um, okay, so let's just- go here. And I, I missed some stuff um, in the village, sadly. I missed one of the goats. I don't think I'm gonna get all the goats this time. Right. <clears throat> what do I put in here? Could fit in this depression. Okay, so that's the thing we saw. We saw that in the... On, on the doll there. I guess the key, is that the key? And then something could fit in here, but I don't have anything. Examine left eye. Oh shit, I didn't do that. Okay. 
So that's an eagle facing what way? Because there were two. Facing the right. What is that? A sink. What can I do with this sink? It was like the water works here. Okay. Drink it then or some shit. Oh! <laughs> yeah, just clean the ring, man. I, th I think it's your wedding ring, to be honest. So what do you want me to do with this? Oh, there's a code. <sighs> okay, there's... Oh, okay. I didn't see this. There's a code on this. So it was... Let me see if my memory is good. 0529... 11. Brain, bro. I got a brain in here. <laughs> oh! You really want me to go in here? Well, guess what, bitch? I ain't. Fuck off. Nah, I'm gonna go in here since it opened. I'm genuinely terrified. As I said in the last episode, I hate the house setting. It scares me so much. Why is this here? Silver key? This? Oh no, it's the other thing. It winds it up, right? Man, I got chills. What? How would I know which ones are which, though? And how to get them into order? Maybe I need something for that. What's in here? Why'd you let me open this? I can hide? And there's no way of telling which one's which. I might have to look this one up. <laughs> I hate cheating, but I don't know. I don't know if they're gonna give us something to help us with that, or... Am I gonna have to... Fucking... Okay, so we get the tweezers from the music box. Storage music box. Match the scratches on the box. Cylinder. I was kind of thinking the sc scratches had something to do, but I thought like there's pins in the middle that are like kind of gray. I thought those might be something, but I guess not. There you go. Now. Got it right. <laughs> Holy shit. Um, I thought maybe the scratches had something to do with it. But I wasn't too sure. Run back here and get that film thing oh please don't attack me this is a safe zone i need to put a jumper on i this game gave me chills and now i'm cold Also, you didn't tell me our baby's fucking possessed or some shit. The game's getting kind of scary. It's like I'm reluctant to continue. Oh! Right there. Why am I so scared? I'm actually getting more scared by this game. This game's becoming terrifying slowly. Like, I actually don't know what's happening next. Like, I'm still going into this game blind. There's only an elevator here, though. Oh, there's a room in there. Is there anything in here, though? It doesn't fit this lock. Power is out? How? Well, maybe only for the elevator. Oh, here. Yes, we got a film here. What does it say? 
Our happy family. One, Rose, best friend in the whole wide world. Two, she really likes this fairy tale. Three, the most important thing in the world to us. Four, a wedding gift from grandma. Five, proof of Ethan's everlasting love for me. Who wrote that? No projector. All right. Oh, okay, so this is a part of a puzzle. Teddy bear. This. And this. So grandma gave us this. Okay, play the film. A well. What is this, the fucking ring? Bombo clat! Alright, we move. Oh, this is a very tight place. I don't like this. And they're surrounded by dolls, bruh. Fuck. Scissors. I can go back, right? Wait, let me go back and get what's in the bandage. <gasps> Why is that open? That was a very loud bang there. Scissors. This game is actually starting to be terrifying. Like, I, d I didn't find it, like, terrifying before, but holy fuck. Oh. So is Mia alive and they captured her? That may be lit if Mia's okay. She fit. That is so dark. I don't like this. I don't like this. Oh, that's the well. I'm not gonna go here. I'm not gonna go here right now. How'd you run this slow? This ain't running, this is like jogging. Alright, let's go here. Because this leads somewhere. Oh, I need something for this. Alright. No, that's just bandages, right? Scissors. Pick up the phone. Bow, bow. This is so creepy, bro, because it's in the fucking house. I hate the house, man. Right? Yep. And I don't have this. Maybe the silver key? Nope. Wouldn't fit into this depression. I hate how they call it, though. Oh, so I need a baby thing. I thought I just saw something there from the corner of my eye. So we need a little baby statue, and I'm guessing this leads to here? Yep. So I guess we do have to go to the well, so... Here we go. Cuts games, don't be a pussy, man. Just don't be a pussy. This game's giving me the same feelings that Phasmophobia did at the start when I used to play it. Like, it's just giving me chills. Like, I just don't know what's gonna happen next. And I feel v vulnerable. Going down the well, though. Breaker box key. Is that all that's down here? I'm afraid that's not it, mate. I'm afraid there's gonna be more. Yep. What is happening? What just broke?
Who's got my baby? Can I not save anymore? So is she alive or not? What the fuck? That's locked. Why is this so long? Are these like intestines? Intestines aren't this long. What the fuck is that? What? Am I dead? Oh, I did die. <laughs> I guess I got too close. What? Whose baby is- is that my baby? So I guess I gotta outrun it. I mean, I can't fight her right now. gonna get faster open I'm gonna hide I can't hide anywhere I can hide in here does this even work is this gonna work no it knows I'm here It's right there. Oh, it's walking away. Are we gonna get chased by that thing? Fuck do I go? Okay. Oh, there's no door here. Open this bitch. Turn on that bitch. Is that all I get? Turn it on. A fuse. Did I walk past the okay, it's here. That is unholy, man. Somehow beat it. I was, I was for sure. Like, I thought that's not gonna work at all. Something gonna chase me around here now. I still don't understand how monsters like that, like, happen. What is this place? Oh no! And 
another thing I can hide in. The old fucking baby's gonna be right outside. I can tell. <laughs> oh shit! Was it there? No! No! Oh my god! Is that my kid? How do I outrun it? He's gonna block my way. Do I just wait for it to go away? Is it just gonna disappear now, or do I have to, like... Do I have to juke him? Alright, music is gone. Look at all that shit. Maybe, like, he goes here, and then I have to go outrun him. I hope it's just gone. And go all the way around. Is this even a safe spot? <laughs> it ain't really a safe spot because he comes here anyways. I swear. Can I just go? And do what I have to? Oh, it's back. Go! Ah! Go! Open. Open. I hate that. I hate that. That's just. Oh my god. That is genuinely terrifying. 
You fucking doll. <laughs> Thanks for the bad frames, game. Listen. Can we just do it peacefully? I'm not here to hurt anyone. Don't leave. I can't let you. You're still alive. Huh? <laughs> Before my friends murder you. Tick tock. Your life's on the line. Wait. Try and find me. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try. Dolls twitching and shit. I'm gonna try. I mean, with this frame rate, it's gonna be difficult. Upstairs? We haven't been up here yet. There you are. Come here, you bitch. Fucking monster. <laughs> Damn, a doll that like gets bloody. Why do you let me that let me open that if that ain't even uh, it's nothing in? Damn, she kind of fit though. Not the doll, the the owner of the doll. Where are you? Over here. Hell no, that was my kid. What are you saying? Don't have sex with it. What are you doing to my cute friends? <laughs> Jesus. Oh. It's over. Mia. I'll make things right. What is that? What? Good. I need to get out of this place. What is that key for? What is this? Combined with four... Combined with four... Oh! So that's who was behind all this? Lex. That makes two. Now I gotta get the fuck out of here, right? Am I gonna sell her? Why can't I open this, though? Oh, now I can. Get the fuck out of this place. I hate this place with a passion. I hate it so much. That baby shit was the most terrifying thing in Resident Evil history, bro. From what I've... Experience of Resident Evil, which ain't much, cause I only this is my third game. I I never actually got to finish uh, RE7 though. I got to the granny part and then just got bored. I think I did a let's play on it. I don't know what happened to that let's play. I remember I played the demo on Xbox One and I actually did upload that. I streamed my Xbox One to like the Xbox app on the computer and I recorded that. It was so bad. It worked though, uh, but I had shitty internet, so it was very very not good. All right. <clears throat> I think when we were in this elevator before I missed something. I don't know. I'm gonna watch another guy play this play this part of the game to see the reaction So I'm gonna see if I think I missed something in the elevator because when the lights turned off I think I missed something. Okay um, Can we get this treasure now? How do I get this fucking thing? I just want to know just in case I can't go into this place like the Dimitrescu place. Benevento grave This must be done right after leaving. Okay. 
Go back to the in the village and you should see a couple of enemies. We're going to open a gate that leads to a stone slab. Oh, there will be a mini boss here. So come prepared or ready to run. Okay, I remember this. So we need the slab. Okay, I wish I saw that because I thought that was dust. Like I thought that was dust covering the name, but it's actually there's a part of that stone missing. Um, so yeah, next stop is this grave place. <laughs> What is this spot? Was I here before? I don't think I was. What's up, man? Holy shit! Why they take so long to kill? Ow, oh, man, get the fuck off me, man. Damn, these guys are tough. What? I can't pronounce tough. Okay, I get it. ASAP, fuck off. Damn, they take a lot to kill. What? Alright, there's a guard option. I, I, I'd never use that. gonna waste ammo on you damn that takes so long man all right what's in here lock pick and what a spas and a mine that's great i definitely have a lot of space for that and some money Where's this cunt? I hear him. Oh, there he is. I wonder if block and actually doesn't take away any health. I don't think it does, right? Oh no, it does. Okay, it does. It just takes less than getting actually hit. Fuck off, man. Let's go up here. What? Oh, this is one of the puzzles. I bet you they're not gonna give me the thing. Luthier's key, we got that, yes. This game falls into place so easily. Like, I'm like, well, how do I get this? Well, how do I get that? And then I'm like, oh, how do I get this? And then I'm like, and then I just stumble upon the things I need. Anyways, I'm gonna read this. November 10th. Mistress Donna is now Mother Miranda's adopted daughter. In all my years, I've never been this overjoyed. Who's Mistress Donna? Uh, ever since childhood, she has always feared others due to the scar across her face. After her parents' death, she locked herself away and was only was and would only talk to Angie, the doll her father made for her. I am forever thankful to Mother Miranda for infinite compassion. Mrs. Donna seems happy. It might be my imagination, but I feel like her doll Angie is even more lively than before. So, Do uh, so Mrs. Donna is, I think, the one that was holding the doll. Uh, she came to me in the garden today and used Angie to talk with me. Uh, we had a mighty fine conversation. Something about receiving a gift of power from mother. Uh, Mrs. Donna gave me fellow or yellow uh, flowers and told me to plant them in the garden. I plant them in front of uh, Miss Claudia's grave. I don't know if it was the scent of the flowers, but I felt lightheaded. Then, like a dream, I saw my departed wife. Oh, that, like we saw our wife. So maybe it's those fucking flowers that do that. I mentioned this to Donna and she seemed thrilled by it. She told me to go to the house tomorrow and see her. Uh, she said I could see my family once more. I'm not sure what that meant, but she's so kind. And she probably killed you. That's why you can see your family, because you're up in heaven. Ooh, a well thing.
Maybe this is where we get the ball. All right, so from that, I got fucking interrupted. From, from that, uh, we have the doll head, which we got the body before. I'm gonna make just a bunch of first aid. Okay, I can only make one. Nice. If I combine two items, it becomes more viable than selling just one part. Is there gonna be a zombie in here? I'm waiting for that to happen. Photo of strange bird. So that's in the cemetery. So that's like where we have to go to get the Beneviento stone. I think I'm pronouncing the name right. I'm not too sure. At least I nailed Dimitrescu instead of saying Dimitrescu. All right, we're going on forward. I want to get the Beneviento treasure and hopefully end this episode. Uh, I'm not. I'm not sure how long I'm recording. I should fucking put a timer on. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, go think. I'm leaving. I'm not fighting those guys. Although I think there's a limited amount. They don't spawn endlessly. I think like... Th they put three of them there. And then... That's it. Oh, that's... There's a stone. Wait, does that combine with the thing so? And how did I miss that before? I'm just not gonna fight them. I'll fight them later. Not right now. Not in the mood, man. Not in the mood. I just want to see Duke's face again. Because I miss this guy. Duke! How are y'all feeling? Does this look familiar to you? Yes. Alright. Uh, I'm going to sell some stuff. I, I got a lot of lay, but I, I'm i not getting laid. Am I right, guys? That's a Michael Michael Scott fucking joke from the, from the office. That's a joke he would make. I'm going to sell Lady Dimitrescu. I don't need that. Probably don't need Angie as well. And that's it. I'm gonna ah, get... Miss Angie. Just adorable. Porcelain, do let me know if you find- Okay, so just don't finish your sentence then. Alright, I'm gonna buy all the fucking ammo I can. So basically, fuck all. Because he's a waste man and he literally has nothing. I'm just gonna upgrade it. Because, like, you get so much fucking handgun ammo in this, so it's good to do this. I'll upgrade it. It's, it's gonna be OP as fuck. So that has, like, 190 attack now. Alright, let's get the tombstone thing. There's an ammo here. There's gonna be a mini boss over there next to that treasure. Which I think there's gonna be a... Those types of things on every tre near near every treasure. The Resident Evil developers wouldn't just let you have a fucking treasure like that. Um, so yeah, broken slab. Also, where's that blue bird? There it is. Do I shoot it? I killed it. <laughs> Juicy game! Let's move on and get that Beneviento treasure. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. What the fuck? <laughs> it's a goat! What's in here? <gasps> We got the ball! Let me do this puzzle. Everybody do the flop. Yay! Onyx skull! I think onyx is like a type of metal. I don't know why I'm saving to the second slot. Uh, but yeah, it's a type of metal. Uh, and that's all I know. Right, let's go to the Beneviento thing. I have 14 shotgun ammo. I don't think that's gonna be enough for this mini boss. All right, here we go. Oh, that's that type of mini boss. Okay. How would I kill him? Do I have pipe bombs? I should have bought some. Fuck. I could use a landmine though. I have a landmine. All right, okay. Set it. Go! Come on, walk over it. I didn't phase him at all. He's right on my ass! What? Man, die! How do you beat this guy? I don't want to waste my ammo. Come prepare or be ready to run. So I guess I can go and just run away with the treasure. I hope so. I don't know how to beat this guy. I think I need pipe bombs and I ain't, I ain't got any. Come on, miss. Let me place it, man. 
Jesus Christ, that was very close. I don't think he's phased by my... What about explosive rounds? How do they work? Place the stone! No, that's the bird thing! Where the fuck is the thing? Broken slab. Now what? He's on my ass. Oh, he's on my ass! I'm running. I'm running! I don't even need to be here anymore. I got the thing. I'm running. I'm going away. Good luck, man. Have a nice day. You can do whatever you fucking do. I'm gone. See ya, man. What's up, man? Something in particular. I'm seeking a lot, bro. Oh, I sold him the shotgun and now he's selling it back to me. That's great. Sell large crystal. Sell th oh, this, sell this. Okay, well, anyways. I'm gonna leave I it off here. Seeing the fruits of your exploration. Uh, shut up. Uh, thank you guys for watching. This has been Cats Games. See you next episode. Peace.